or the lower court was right. Gender Cabinet Secretary Aisha Jumwa says there's need to tighten laws on gender-based violence so as to expose perpetrators. Speaking after opening and handing to the county government of Vihiga a gender-based violence center, Aisha Jumwa says the laws appear to favor females, yet the males too are victims, although they tend to keep quiet about their suffering. Rampant use of chip liquor has also been blamed for violence against women, leaders calling for concerted efforts to contain the menace even as a clarion call to increase the National Government Affirmative Action Fund allocation was made. Empowerment. Cases of gender-based violence have been on the rise in communities, even as steps are taken to contain the menace, besides providing safe havens for victims, be it rape or physical injuries. Opa. Gender Cabinet Secretary Aisha Juma, while in Vihiga County, noted that women matters were among President William Ruto's nine-point agenda, and thus their safety and access to equal opportunities is his ministry's objective. Ali. The CS, however, noted that although both genders are susceptible to violence, females are more vulnerable. Sisi tunaongea, sisi wakina mama. Tukipigwa, sisi hatunyamazi. Tukithulumiwa, sisi hatunyamazi. Lakini kina baba... Munaona aibu, hamutaki kuongea, na ndio mana munaumia, lakini sheria ni ile moja inayo mlinda mama, itakulinda paka wewe baba. Speaking while commissioning and handing over to the county government of Vihiga, the newly constructed gender-based violence center, which is the fourth in the country, Juma also pointed out consumption of cheap liquor is to blame for violence. The rot in the society has worsened due to lack of counseling services, besides young girls lacking safe places, even in the least expected places like police stations. Life is Life is worth living in a dignified manner. Na wakati unadhulumu mwenzako, ataibaba in the rest of our life. Sodomy, though largely reported, victims always keep to themselves for fear of shame and stigma. Good morning. Sensitization, they say, will help, even as they made a clarion call to increase national government affirmative action funds allocation. Kwa hivyo hii pesa ya ngaf, inafanya kazi waziri, I pesa sio mchezo ni kidogo yes vile tunalia ziongezwe tafadhali enda ambia rais alituongeza 1 billion pia akipenda next atuongeze bilioni ingine na ingine ama atupatie count women reps pesa the same as constituency MPs to achieve equality in the political arena, women leaders have tipped women to go for higher seats, including the governor's seats, and move from the current seven to at least 16 in 2027. Alano Chanda, KTN News. A group of women from Kiriswa Block 1, Kapchunga area in Wasingishu 